Hey everybody, World Terrorist Cheerleader here again for our daily walk and talk. Uh, feeling a little bit better today. You know, I just got to keep reminding myself that it's okay to reach out to my friends. It's okay to talk to them. It's okay to let it out and not, not hold it in. Uh, just with everything going on around the world right now, it's kind of crazy. We're having to adjust, and these are times not a lot of us have ever experienced. So, and I know that was putting a lot of pressure on me for some of my events and some of the things I'm trying to organize or try to to lead. <clears throat> Pardon me. Uh, that's allergy, and I just had some drink. It's a, not a dry cough, so I'm good. But I just, yeah, this is showing me, though, it, it's showing me who I can trust to be sensible, who I can trust to make sound judgments, and who's looking out for uh, the other. And that's something we need to do right now. You know, it's not, for me, it's not just enough about keeping me safe, about keeping myself healthy. You know, I, I, I may never know I've got some, but it's, and it's like this with, you know, other immunities and diseases and things like that. You can't just think about yourself. You know, you have to think about how your actions would affect a neighbor in their health and such. So, while we may have all laughed at the cancellations and things like that it's a case of limiting limiting your contact to stifle the spread of the, the virus and again I'm not a doctor this is from my research from what I've read you know don't take me as a medical expert I'm not it's just my view uh, but anyway, yeah, there's going to be a lot of there's going to be a lot of businesses that are affected that are going to be affected by this. A lot of restaurants, theaters, clubs, comic book shops, movie theaters. You know, a lot of folks that are going to be that are going to be hurting by this, especially with a lot of conventions and festivals and such, and rodeos closing and not being held this year there's a lot of people that this could potentially destroy and all I would ask of anyone who is going to go to any of these events reach out to the vendors that you would have gone to support uh, reach out to those crafters find out how you can buy their merchandise find out how you can buy their product <clears throat> to keep them going you, know, you you'll still get your merch and at least in the case of one candy shop that I ran across today from the Houston rodeo they're still offering the special festival pricing so you know take advantage of it help out a small business you know reach out to these festivals that may be canceled and find out how you can help the crafters and the merchants these are not just big corporations that are being affected you know it's everybody and it's it's important that we all I can't stress this enough I mean it's you know, we're all in this together or not, see it or not. We, we have to we have to be there for each other so please look for those small crafters those small vendors the artists that are going to lose hundreds or if not thousands in revenue and this could be the end for them find them, reach out to them, order their products. A lot of them will have online shops or may put up 
online shops just to deal with this. Consider supporting them like you would if you'd actually gone to whatever event it is. There are some that can weather this and some that can ride it out, but a large majority of them can't. So please, please consider finding them, supporting them, sharing their information. Even if you can't necessarily purchase, get their information out. Spread the word. And, you know, let's try to help each other like we, you know, like we should. Anyway, uh, that's what I wanted to talk about today. Please, you know, do what you can. There are a lot of good folks out there that are going to lose everything. So, please help each other. Anyway, thank you. I really do appreciate it. I know I said I'd get that random winner drawn and chosen. And I still will. It's just with the chaos of this week, it's kind of had to put get put on the back burner. But uh, I promise you, I will get something out. Thanks a lot, everybody. I appreciate you. I thank you, and I love you. Bye.